Have you ever stopped to consider just how much of your daily life is now lived online? Every day we interact with the digital world in ways both big and small, sometimes without even realizing it. OSINT is essentially the art of finding what you've already shared, sometimes without even realizing it. It's about connecting the dots you never meant to leave behind. Understanding the scope of your digital shadow is the crucial first step to protecting yourself. By learning about digital privacy and taking proactive steps, you can start to reclaim control over your online identity. Before we go further, remember, this knowledge is for defense, not attack. The goal is to help you recognize risks and secure your digital life, not to enable illegal or unethical behavior. OSINT techniques are used by journalists, law enforcement, and cybersecurity professionals for good. The difference is intent. Use this information to protect, not to harm. Think of it as learning how a burglar might break in, so you can lock your own doors. As you watch, put yourself in the shoes of a defender. Consider what you've exposed and how you can close those gaps. Knowledge is power. Use it responsibly. OSINT stands for Open Source Intelligence, gathering and analyzing information that's publicly available and legal to access. It's not about hacking into systems, but about finding what's already out there. Sources include social media, public records, news articles, forums, satellite images, and data breaches. The real power of OSINT is in connecting small, harmless details to reveal a bigger picture. A pet's name, a birthday post, or a photo of your commute can all become clues. Hackers use OSINT to build profiles, answer security questions, and craft convincing scams. It's the reconnaissance phase, quiet, effective, and often invisible. The more data points collected, the more complete the picture. OSINT is about connecting dots you didn't know you left behind. That's why understanding it is crucial for your security. Social media is a goldmine for OSINT, open source intelligence. Every day, billions of people share snippets of their lives online, often without a second thought. But what seems like harmless sharing can actually be a treasure trove for those who know how to look. We carefully curate our profiles, posting names, birthdays, workplaces, and family connections, sometimes even making this information visible to the public. These details, while seemingly innocent, can be the first pieces of a much larger puzzle. A hacker or investigator can start with just your name. In a matter of minutes, they can uncover your network of friends, your daily routines, and even the answers to common security questions, like your mother's maiden name or your first pet. Posts, photos, and check-ins reveal more than you think. They can show where you've been, who you were with, and even hint at your future plans or regular habits. Even your likes, comments, and group memberships can expose your interests, beliefs, and affiliations, painting a detailed picture of who you are and what matters to you. Attackers don't just stick to one platform. They cross-reference Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, and X, piecing together information from each to build a multi-layered, comprehensive profile of your digital life. Reusing the same username across different sites, that can link your anonymous accounts back to your real identity, making it even easier to track you across the web. Sometimes a single photo or a casual comment can connect your entire digital footprint, linking friends, locations, and even your offline life. The more you share, the more complete the picture becomes. Each post, photo, or detail is another piece of your story, making it easier for someone to assemble your profile. Remember, social media isn't just for friends and family. It's for anyone who knows where to look. Strangers, companies, and even malicious actors can access what you make public. Every post, no matter how small, is a potential clue. A birthday wish, a tagged location, or a shared memory can all be used to learn more about you. Your online presence is like a public record, documenting your life over time. It's a timeline that anyone can scroll through, revealing your past and sometimes even predicting your future. So before you hit post, pause and think. Be mindful of what you reveal, because once it's online, it's out of your hands, and you never know who might be watching. Public records are another rich source of information. Property records, voter registrations, business filings, and court documents are often just a search away. These records confirm your address, date of birth, and even your legal history. Hackers use this data to validate what they find on social media and fill in missing details. With just a name and city, someone can find your home address, see your house on Google Street View, and learn about your family or business ties. Data brokers aggregate these records, making it easy to run comprehensive background checks online. Official data adds credibility to a hacker's profile of you. You may not have chosen to share this information, but it's out there. Public records are the backbone of identity theft and impersonation. 
Know what's available about you and take steps to protect it. Every photo you post can reveal more than you think. Reverse image search tools like Google Images or TinEye. Let anyone find where else your photo appears online. A profile picture can link anonymous accounts to your real identity in seconds. Background details in photos, landmarks, street signs, or unique buildings can pinpoint your location. Even if you don't tag a location, someone can triangulate where a photo was taken using visual clues and satellite imagery. Metadata or EXIF data embedded in image files can include GPS coordinates and timestamps. Some platforms strip this data, but not all. A single image can compromise your privacy and security. Before posting, consider what your photos might reveal. Images are powerful OSINT tools, use them wisely. Data breaches are now routine, exposing millions of emails, passwords, and personal details. Stolen data is sold or shared on the dark web, giving attackers a shortcut into your accounts. Hackers use leaked credentials for credential stuffing, trying old passwords on new sites, hoping you reused them. Tools like Have I Been Puyund let you check if your data was compromised, but attackers have even more advanced resources. Breach data reveals not just passwords, but also your online habits and memberships. Even encrypted passwords can be cracked with modern tools. Old breaches can haunt you for years. Change passwords regularly and never reuse them. The true strength of OSINT, open source intelligence, lies in its ability to gather and combine information from countless sources, both obvious and hidden. It's not just about finding one piece of data, but about weaving together a tapestry of details from all over the internet and public records. Imagine a hacker starting with just a single username. From there, they might uncover a Twitter account, which then leads them to Instagram, Facebook, LinkedIn, and even public records databases. Each platform offers new clues, and each clue brings them closer to building a complete picture of you. Every small detail matters. Your school, your hometown, your family members, your favorite sports team, or even the places you visit. These fragments, when connected, help fill in the puzzle of your identity, making it more complete with every discovery. Data leaks and breaches can expose sensitive information like passwords, email addresses, and even security questions. This information, once public, can be used to access your accounts or impersonate you online. The photos you post reveal more than you think, your face, your car, your house, and even your daily routines. Each image is a window into your life, offering more context to anyone watching. Frequent check-ins, tagged locations, and daily posts can map out your habits, your favorite spots, and your schedule, making it easier for someone to predict your movements. With enough information, an attacker can convincingly impersonate you, answer your security questions, or craft highly targeted phishing attacks that are difficult to spot. What's most alarming is that all of this can be done legally, without breaking into any systems or violating any laws. OSINT relies on what you've already made public. The more you share online, photos, updates, personal milestones, the easier it becomes for someone to target you. Every post adds another piece to the puzzle. OSINT is all about connecting the dots you never realized you left behind, forming a web of information that can be traced back to you. Your digital life is like a giant puzzle. The more pieces you leave out in the open, the easier it is for someone to put them together and see the full picture. Don't make it easy for them. Staying aware of what you share and who can see it is your best defense. Vigilance is key in protecting your digital identity. Take control of your story. Protect your information before someone else decides to use it against you. Your privacy is worth defending. Feeling exposed? You can take back control. Start by searching your own name, usernames, and emails to see what's public. Lock down your social media, set profiles to private, hide friends lists, and limit what you share. Be cautious with photos and check-ins. Avoid revealing locations or routines. Use strong, unique passwords for every account and store them in a reputable password manager. Enable two-factor authentication wherever possible. Monitor your email addresses for breaches using tools like Have I Been PDYund. If your data is compromised, change passwords immediately. Consider using data broker removal services to reduce your exposure. Remember, online safety is an ongoing process. Stay vigilant, update your habits, and keep learning about new threats. You can't erase your digital shadow, but you can shrink it. Take action now. Your privacy is worth it.